Hey, what's up you guys? Chuck Curtis here. Are you curious about what it's like to be a regional truck driver? In this video, I'm going to be talking about some of the pros and some of the cons to regional truck driving coming up. Pro number one, I would have to say staying close to home. You're usually assigned to a particular area of the United States. Example, I cover Washington, Oregon, Idaho, and Montana. Those are the states I cover, so I love being close to home. Not only do you get to stay close to your hometown, if you have any family emergencies out on the road, then you can definitely zip home a lot quicker and smash that like button than if you were all the way clear across the United States. Not only that, I drive for about, I don't know, 10 hours max usually I'm out max a couple days and then I'm home over the road drivers they're gone for weeks months at a time I'm not saying I couldn't handle that but I got a family so I'd rather be home spending more time with the family so I'd rather stay somewhere around here rather rather than going to New York or Florida Tennessee Texas so if you're trying to be a truck driver and that's what you want to do is see the whole United States then I would say regional is not for you over the road would be for you pro number two becoming more familiar with the major highways and the routes you're running so most likely you're going to be running the same routes with that you get more familiar with the routes which which is huge because you'll be able to learn the traffic patterns you'll be able to know when it's when it's busy rush hour when it's slow we definitely like traveling when there's not too many cars out I get it we do it when there is heavy heavy traffic snow all kinds of weather so I think that's a huge, another huge benefit is uh, learning where you're going. That way you won't get lost like I did yesterday. It was pretty bad. Narrow road, uh, one lane, you know, going in each direction. I had to take up both lanes for some of these turns because I got lost, didn't know where I was going. It was so narrow. But you know, it's all part of the job. And when you're a rookie, you're going to, you're gonna run into those things. So that's definitely a pro, is learning the major highways and the routes. Pro number three. Pro number three. You're still racking up the miles and you still get to travel. And you get paid pretty good. Who doesn't wanna get paid to travel, right? So it's definitely a pro. But hey, I'm curious, are any of you guys regional truck drivers or thinking about becoming a regional truck driver? If so, comment regional down below. So we talked about some of the pros. Now let's talk about some of the cons. Con number one, slip seating. It smells like brakes, woo! not smell good so slip seating basically slip seating is when you go off duty another driver will go in and take your tractor for for a couple days or whatever when you go on duty you're taking someone else's tractor and so on they're, they're not assigned so with that you're having to take all your belongings all your stuff your water your camera gear your GPS your backpack everything bed sheets you're bouncing that around from tractor to tractor con number two usually you stay in one region regional truck driver so some people some people don't like that you know they might come out of CDL school like I did pick up a truck driving job and not realize they're only staying regional when in their mind they thought that they were going to New York Tennessee, Florida, 
you know, traveling across the United States, they're thinking, what is this? Uh, yeah, you just stay regional. So yeah, if you're looking to go over the road, long distance, regional is not for you. Definitely not. Con number three, I would say your schedule. Your schedule is definitely going to be inconsistent for a while when you start your new job. One day they have me going to Billings, Montana. The next they have me going down to Central Point, Oregon. So as you can see, very inconsistent there. However, it is very rewarding. I promise you that. Very rewarding. Stick it out and you'll be rewarded well. In addition to scheduling, high level of stress. Some of these stores I go to, you gotta back down an alley and do a 90. So, you know, if you're a rookie, that might be tough. You know, all you veterans, you got this, you got this. But for new people, that might be very daunting and scary. It's all part of the game, baby, all part of the game. All right, guys, those are some of the pros and cons to regional truck driving. Don't forget to subscribe. That way you won't miss any videos I release. Also, real quick, guys, if you're curious as a truck driver, what kind of camera gear I'm using, what kind of mic, what kind of GPS, and what kind of mounts and stuff I'm using. I do have links down in the description below you can check out. Until then, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.